drugs are not good and marijuana is the foundation of all drugs. It is. I'm telling you it is because I experienced it. It's the foundation of all drugs. And it leads to the next thing because what I learned in my studies of dealing with this is that they want to get the first high that they ever got. So if you want to get the first high you got, if you have to go to another drug, whatever, whatever you have to do to get this high, you're going to get this high because after a while, it's like with anything, you get immune to it. And now I'm immune to it, I need something else. If I got a product that I want to sell you, and I could convince you and you can make a difference in my product, I'm going to take care of you. I'm going to take care of you, yes, financially, whatever it takes, I'm going to try to get you to back me. And if you contribute to me selling my product, of course, I'm going to come talk to you about selling my product. It's even the same thing with a, a drug dealer, basically. The same thing as a drug dealer. A drug dealer is going to try to convince you, they, listen, my drug is better than so-and-so. Try it, this and that. Here, a matter of fact, here's a sample. Here's this and all. There you go. So it's basically, it's, uh, lobbyists are basically drug dealers. They're telling them one thing and I'm saying something else. So it's hard, it's hard for them to, to, to grasp onto what I'm saying. I mean, I saw them sell things, I saw them break into things, I saw all kind of stuff. Wake up, people. Wake up to the realities. I mean, we could have our blinders on for as long until they hit something. Then all of a sudden, oh, did you hear about Joey's kid? Or did you hear about Mimi's kid? Or my nephew? We don't want to accept it till they actually hit home. You're multiplying something. That's what you're doing. You're multiplying. And we have took the wrong and we've made it right. And uh, I think it's very wrong. Just for a dollar, I think it's wrong. It's a lot of everybody at stake.